Emily here with the Graphics Fairy. I just received a couple packages in the mail and these were lots of ephemera that we purchased from France. So I wanted to come on here real quick and open these and give you a sneak peek of what's coming hopefully in the near future. So we had two packages. This one I absolutely loved how the seller added all of these stamps. It looks really cute. I started to take this out already because the first time I started filming, the dog was at the door and started whining. So I had to do a retake. So I've already opened the packages. Um, this was a bunch of ephemera and already I can see some great pieces. So let's dive in real quick. This one looks like it has some cabinet cards. And how cute is that? So we have a little girl. There's a little boy, it looks like almost a sailor's outfit. And another young one. Another girl. And this looks like a retake of our first one. Got a little smile out of her this time. And this one's really sweet. I don't know if you can see it. Um, this little one looks like she might have been moving when they were taking the picture. So you can, there's a little blurriness near her hand where she probably was moving, which is really cute. And I love looking on the back of these cabinet cards. Some of them have some really neat topography. And I don't even know if you can, maybe the light can catch that really beautiful gold printing on these. So these are really nice quality. I even like looking at the different shades of colors of paper as well. So those look really neat. Um, there were some different pieces of ephemera. And when you're buying lots like this, you know, we tend to, to buy them for a few main pieces in the lot. We may not love absolutely everything, but you know, if we see something, we may buy the entire lot. And it's neat to look on the back too, because sometimes you get some interesting surprises. The front may not be that exciting, um, but the back may have some great advertising on it. This looks like um, maybe a banquet. There's a menu and they have some cute little tickets. Lots of our members like when we include little pieces of ephemera like tickets like this. So that looks great. There's a hotel piece. This one has some nice embossing on it. And a nice gold aged gold printing too. This looks like a benefit. Here's a banquet. A little menu on the back. Be nice for a project as well. My favorite things are the receipts. These are nice and big too. I love this one because it has the orange. You don't see orange printing too often. Um, this one looks like it's for probably a printer. Um, they do letterhead envelopes and looks like they specialize in pharmacy labels. This one's from 1904, I think, 1904, 1906. Here's hardware. Looks like a cotton factory, or maybe they make garments. This I really absolutely love. Um, this looks like a piece of ephemera from a printer's book, maybe where you choose what type of edging or printing that you'd want for your project, but 
these make some really interesting borders and this would be perfect. I love the details and intricacies. This is really fine engraving. It reminds me a lot of um, the engraving you'll see on some money. Um, it's really pretty, I love that. Uh, this looks like pharmacy products. I love the, the Paris. And this one looks like more window hardware. Let me open this last packet of ephemera. So again, always in these large ephemera lots, you'll see things that you absolutely love and then things you kind of just put to the side. This is really pretty. The roses. This looks like um, liqueur. Again, with the really pretty gold printing. This looks like trellises. This is chocolate, I think. So maybe you can't use the front too much, but always look at the back. Sometimes they have some great advertising. This is really cute. This has some great advertising on the back. This looks like they sell clothing for and uniforms for children. Um, and it looks like we have a few different pieces of alcohol ephemera, labels and such, and a menu. So that's that set. Let me grab this one. This was a um, hardware book for furniture. I even love looking at the old pieces of parchment because sometimes we'll even scan something like this in um, and they're just great for backgrounds, great for adding a layer, especially if you're gonna do any digital work. So this has a lot of different locks and hardware. Some great keys here. This is great furniture hardware, very intricate. One of the ways that we like to use hardware and hinges, we've started putting them on some of our journaling pages so that it looks like the page has a hinge that holds it together and that's really neat. Um, these keyholes are really pretty too. Really fine detail on these. We have some hooks. And let's see. There's some ironwork too. These are great. Um, I love using these types of images in garden scenes or combining them with birds or flowers. They look really pretty. So I think we'll stop there on this one. Um, but these are some of the different pieces of ephemera that we just got. So I'm really excited about that, especially I like the photographs. There's some great receipts in this bunch that I think everyone will really like. So I'm gonna get started scanning those and you will see them shortly in some bundles on the site. Don't forget, if you'd like to see more sneak peeks of some of the packages and prints that we're putting together for future bundles to show you on the membership site, please be sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel for any updates. We'll see you next week. Bye, everyone.